Hey everybody, I'm Jacob back again with another video, and this is part 6, part 2. And in this part, we are taking on the convicts. Now, I've just set the waypoint, so all my uh, survivors go together, so I don't lose them, because they'd end up dying if it was me. Um, that wouldn't be very helpful. So, I'm just going over now to meet Sophie, who, as you saw in the cutscene, she was walking with her dad, maybe, and she got attacked by the convicts. And all you got to do is walk over to her, and she's running off of me. Uh, you just got to walk off, and now she'll go to the waypoint as well, and I'm going to take on the convicts. Now, I can't see them at the moment. No, no there they are. So I'm going to try and snipe them. It seems they've got stuck, so this could work to my advantage. And this... Oh, yes! That's one down. And for this one, I'm going to try and kill them up as, as you can see, oh, no, I got shot. Oh! To the driver now to try and take his gun. But no, no, yeah, that's that zombie goes from the corner. Um, yeah. Oh, this isn't going to go in the I've got the gun. No, I'm not going to go in. Oh, okay, that's not back up into me, that's fine. It's not going as bad as I thought. There's only one person left, and I've got nine bullets left, so. This could go surprisingly well. Now, I just missed the ball again, bullets. There's the gun. But I can't reach it. That's not going to Come on. Come on. Oh, I'm terrible at it. I'm just really bad. Two bullets left. Can I do it? Can I do it with one bullet? Yes! Come on. Now, I'll set a waypoint for my survivors. And... I don't know really what I'm doing here. Okay, it's ten to seven. I'm going to try and get out of the park before seven. We'll find out why soon. There's my plant part of doom. And that'll be coming in handy later, I assure you. Now, we have to go and get Lee, because obviously she can't walk. And I'm quite glad she didn't die, because by the rate of it, I thought he was going to. But this video has actually gone surprisingly well so far. So, just, just having a nice casual stroll through the water here. Just on the way to the other survivors. And it's getting pretty dark. So anytime soon, I bet I'll see a cutscene of the leak. There it is! Hooray! September 19th, 7pm. Now, all this basically means is, at 7 o'clock, it gets dark, and all the zombies' eyes will glow red, and when you go outside, the zombies will be quicker, faster, and stronger. Quicker, faster, stronger. I said it's quicker and faster is basically the same thing. So I kinda of messed up there. They'll just be they'll be faster and stronger basically. And then the lights will go out in the mall pretty soon. And then it'll happen inside as well. But as you can see, my tactic has worked. The pink lightsaber has come to my aid. Now this is really useful because otherwise it'd be pitch black right now. So I'm hoping everyone's with me as I come through this door. Otherwise, oh yeah, everyone's with me. That's pretty good. Now I'll just hopefully get everyone through here. Just take me with me first, then set a waypoint. It's going, it's going well so far. We don't seem to be dying. And as soon as I get them through this door, I'll be I'll be all but safe, really. Now I'll put me down here, set the waypoint, 
Oh, Bert's also in here. Got that a policeman. Hopefully not shoot anyone. Some more shooting. I don't think. Now, Sophie and Alan are over there for some reason. Okay, Sophie's in trouble. And then I'll come to her aid, obviously. Now, Sophie's through there. Alan's through as well. This is going well. Now, just uh, quickly run over here. Go through the door. And we are safe. Just gotta get through here now without getting attacked by any zombies. Damn. Oh, this is even better actually. The cutscene you'll see here is the Queen Bee. And when you you will catch the Queen Bee later on and you hold it in a glass container. And if you ever if you ever surrounded by loads of zombies you throw the glass container on the floor and all the zombies around you will be killed. And as you can see here, they just all drop to the ground. It's very useful if you get stuck in the underground or if you're low on health and there's loads of zombies around you. And there's a nice image for everyone. The zombies heads popping off. So, I think when you go over to the elevator you'll be able to catch a queen, but I'm not quite sure. Over there. No, yeah, we got one. We got a queen. And just get past Bert, Aaron and Sophie here. And we'll have to carry Lee. Well, this has been a very good video, and I'm quite surprised everyone's survived. And hopefully, I don't think that after that cuts in, I don't think there's any zombies in the elevator. But, you never know. And this video is getting easier and easier for me, I'm telling you. This has been a great video. I was thinking at least one survivor would die, but that's not been the case. Now just set a waypoint over there. Get Lee. Oh, oh god, sorry Lee. And we're away. Thank you very much. This has gone surprisingly well. I'm quite happy with how this has gone. Thank you for oh. have to push past all these. Move! Seriously, move. Oh my go. god, this is not gone well. Just go to go to that way. I'm gonna have to, yeah, I'm gonna have to kick you. I'm gonna have to kick you to get past. Come, finally. Now that is <coughs> all the survivors rescued there. Bird the Thompson is feeling safer now, <coughs> and that is it. As you can see, there's still a lot of time left until 6 a.m. So in the next video, we'll be facing some more bosses and rescuing some more survivors. So, so thanks for watching. I'll see you then.